Hello everybody and welcome to Assassin's Creed 3. Um, I'm actually kind of excited to bring this to you guys. Um, uh, I've been wanting to play this game since it came out. It was, uh, it finally was a Assassin's Creed that wasn't a, uh, an offshoot of the second one. Uh, where is the, that is options, right? Yes, the options. I'm, uh, sorry, I'm looking for audio. There we are. Let's go five. Five. Actually, music should be lower than voice. So should effects. Um, I got subtitles on in case you guys want to see those. Um, I might have to move my uh, webcam, which I've already done. But uh, a, a good friend of mine uh, got me this game uh, recently. So I decided I was going to do a let's play uh, of it after doing some research. So, without further ado, let's jump into this game. I Halfway through, I might end up switching to a controller. Uh, so, Desmond, no, no thank you. Uh, we will go with Gold Orb. Uh, confirm. Used to be when people talked about the end of the world, we locked them up. Or laughed them off. Sometimes both. But we never took them seriously. Maybe we should have. But I'm getting ahead of myself. Better to start at the beginning with the abduction of Desmond Miles, my son. This boy had no ambition, no direction, no plans for the future. What he did have was a heritage, one he chose to deny. It nearly cost him his life. He was captured and imprisoned. Those who took him believed he could help them find something. The apple. One of several artifacts we call pieces of Eden. Bits of ancient technology scattered across the globe. Some hidden. Some found, all of them dangerous. Most are held by a single group, the same group that now had Desmond. You know them as Abstergo Industries. We know them as the Templars, as the enemy. We've been fighting them for thousands of years, even longer if you believe the stories of their origins. I do. After all, I've seen the truth. That's the beauty and the horror of the Animus. A device that allows us to enter and experience the lives of our ancestors. It holds the power to change everything, to show us history the way it really happened. Up until its creation, to the victor went the spoils, went the truth. We're trying to fix that, to free minds and bodies both. But there's only so much that we can do, and the Templars have the upper hand these days. But something larger than the Assassins and Templars is approaching, bigger than all of us. And if we can't find a way to stop it, these next few weeks will probably be our last. Everyone's last. In the end, it all comes down to him. To Desmond. Through the Animus, he discovered his heritage, explored the lives of his ancestors, and uncovered their secrets. When that was done, he trained. He used another ancestor to provide decades of experience in the span of a few days. It worked. We think. Soon, though, soon we'll know that ominous date fast approaches, December 21st, 2012. None of us knows what it'll bring, only that this is where they want us to be, when it does. They've been guiding us in their own fractured, frustrating way. These voices from the first civilization, the ones who came before, a precursor race of immense power and uncertain motives. They're the ones who made the pieces of Eden. This is where they've led him, and through him, us. He stands at the entrance to this long-lost place, armed with the knowledge of Altair and the abilities of Ezio. He holds in his hands the apple of Eden, and we stand at his side, ready to support him, however we can. His name is Desmond Miles, and he has brought us to the end. The end's not always good. I might turn the volume up a little bit, but uh, yeah, I didn't say anything during that. No, sorry if you couldn't see all the subtitles, but that's also why I was being quiet during that, uh, so you could hear it, hopefully. We're here. Hmm. Yeah, Desmond still looks like a dingus. Of course, that hasn't really ever changed. He's always kind of looked like a dingus. 
from day one. Let's go. Okay. So, oh, is there no options button that I can press? Nope. Okay. Cool. Uh, I like the uh, the backpack physics there. Uh, it moves more naturally than you would expect, really. Um, I can't attack or anything. Look at that. No hope. Ugh. Okay. Can we blow this? Oh, yep, just shove it right in that circle. The O of the no hope. Do it already. Yeah. In another awesome. moment, down went Alice after it, never once considering how in the world she was to get out again. Yeah, good job, you quoted literature. You proved your smarts. I don't remember that guy's name. To me, uh, Desmond and all the other characters in the real world are uh, background characters. Oh, there we go. Uh, I think I just accidentally skipped something. Shit. Uh, I guess I'll have to see. Uh, there we go. Alright. Hmm. Well, let's see if I just accidentally skipped something, shall we? Alright, we're about to find out if I accidentally skipped something. If not, I just went through all that for nothing. Okay, I didn't. I thought I did, but I didn't. Oh well. Uh, it's always good to check, you know? Oh, am I supposed to go down there? Whoa, sorry. <clears throat> Lead you guys the way. Stuff is um pretty sturdy. Been around for I think we're here. thousands of years, <clears throat> and uh, nothing to show for it. Well, actually, there is stuff to show for it. That's why it's sturdy. Whoa, 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 whoa! Hey, dude, you dropped your glow stick. Pick, pick your glow stick up. Pick it up. Stop kicking it. Pick it up. Okay, we'll just follow the glow stick then. Follow the glow stick. It's oh, it's up there. All sorts of crazy stuff. Can I kick this around some more? Nope. Okay. Guess I'll just walk the rest of the way then. <clears throat> oh, I can hold the right mouse button to sprint. That makes sense. I'd rather hold shift to do that, you know. But you know, whatever. There we go. At least I can do stuff. Uh. You know what? I gotta, I gotta check those controls. Got to check those controls. Jump, interact, attack, tools. Wait, why is quick select one, four? That doesn't make any sense. So, should be one, two, three, four. Yeah, like that. And that's how it should work. Precision mode, recruit menu, high profile. Oh, okay. Uh, weapon selector, move, 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 move. Eagle vision, B. Okay. Uh, okay. Well, well then. Unless I can think of something else for that, uh, then I guess that we can keep it as the right mouse button. Would make it easier, I suppose. Ooh. Look at that! It's a thing. It's a glowy shiny thing. Booty booty boom 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 boom. Um, you can do it, uh, demand, Desmond. 
Oh. They just leave the key lying there, I suppose. Then again, you did need the apple of Eden to even get in here, so... But with how much it's falling apart... I wanna give it... Ooh, too much longer before somebody else found it. Hmm. Oh, look, it's a circle. This is neat. Looks like one of those invisible bridges, or light bridges that you found in the first Halo. It's a bridge. Push a button and it drops down. The key. You must find the key. And how am I supposed to know where the key is? Son. Sir. Uh, what? Here we go Here we again. Go again. Desmond? Do you hear a thunk? Yeah. Yeah. What happened? What happened? The temple triggered a bleeding effect. You collapsed oh, and sucks. entered into a fugue state. A fugue, so naturally, eh? Naturally, you dropped me into the animus instead of, I don't know, making sure I was okay. Yeah, totes. You weren't in any danger. Besides, <laughs> the temple appeared to be communicating with you, and I didn't want to risk severing the connection. At least not until we knew what it wanted. Right. Right. Of course. Son, I... No, it's fine. I get it. And I know what I'm looking for, by the way. Yep. It's a key. There's no idea where it is, though. I guess that's why she triggered the bleeding effect. Yeah, probably. She... The higher power. Juno, Dad. She's talking to me. Okay, Desmond. While you were, uh, visiting Constantinople, we picked up a software update for the Animus. Oh, sweet. Run a couple of quick tests. Make sure there aren't any major issues. Okay. All right. What do you need me to do? We'll yeah, exactly. Walk to the marker over there. Oh. I can walk. That's a thing that can happen. Let's keep on walking. Hold right mouse to run. There we go. Uh huh. Right. Okay. And okay, Desmond, jump. Let's practice climbing on these objects. Up. Oh. All right. To start climbing, I can't do it without uh, holding the right mouse button to do the running thing. So this game is going to consist of me holding the right mouse button a lot. Uh, maybe I should uh, move my webcam to the top right. And uh, it probably isn't really a good place for it. I mean, all you can't see is my tools. I got a mini map on the bottom left. Once I get in the game, I'll be able to see uh, where the best place to put my webcam is. Uh, probably top right or top left. Free run your way through this little obstacle course. Okay. I can do that. And jump! Huzzah! Did it, did it, done. And to the next one. There, there, and... Oh, for a second there I thought I was going to fall into a cliff and die. That's uh, a constraint. These are optional oh, objectives that raise your synchronization rate. Alright, Desmond. Follow the on-screen instructions and kill the two Hup. Templars. There we go. Deads. And next. Hup. Yeah, yo. All you have to do here is jump the gap. Alright. Sounds good to me. And, huh. Did it. And next. Jump. And then over there, 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 and then jump. Did it. Oh, yeah, yo. Not like it's hard, but you know, whatever. Um, up we go, I suppose. Huh, jump for no reason! Yeah, yo, I made it. Did it. I'm good at this. Even though it's the tutorial, so you know, everybody's good at it. Oh, I almost hit my head on that. Oh, it sucks. Okay. View progress. Okay, I did the air assassination. Did it. A win. Right. You build this you build this these walls as I walk. You build them real freaking good. 
Attempt. You hear me? You hear me? All right. You better hear me. Can I go sir. over here? Oh. Everything all right, sir? Hey, that's yes. the guy I seen. Fine. I'm just preoccupied. That's all. Oh, Don't okay. Get your invitation. Master Birch will be meeting you inside. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. Where shall I retrieve you once you're done? From Everywhere. The house. And be quick about it. Don't expect to be here long. I'll bring her oh. around at once. I wanted to be here for forever, though. I can't run anymore. They won't let me run. I can't get there. <sighs> hmm. Sorry. Invitation, please. A hat. Shall I take your coat, sir? No, I'm good. You don't need to take my coat. Uh, system message, new email received. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, you are requested to kindly find your seat. Okay. I must kindly find my seat. Fast walk, space. Boop. Can I push past everybody? I don't know what that said up there in the top right. This way, please. Okay. My seat's over there. Oh, I got a apologies. No, no apologies. Don't don't apologize. Nothing's going on for them to see. So you don't have anything to apologize for. Hmm. Hmm. Evening, Haytham. Yeah, Original. evening. I can't tell you how happy I was to hear they'd mounted this revival. Gay's best work by far. Have you seen it before? Once. My father brought me Sweet. here as a child. Though I remember little of it. I don't suppose tonight will afford me the luxury of a proper viewing either. No, probably no, not. I'm afraid it won't. On to business then. Do you see him? Uh, Eagle Vision? Oh! That's gold. Again, I'm partially colored by now. Look, there's more orange to me than gold. In one of the, boxes above. the stairs are watched. We need to find another way up. Oh, yeah. Looks like uh, I already have. Pretty useful path to me. Nobody's gonna notice you flinging around on the, the lights. Find a secluded area to climb. Okay. We need to go this way. I'm so sorry. My nope. apologies. Yeah, don't try to get up while I'm passing, you jerk. I mean, what kind of human being are you? Quit trying to hide. Reginald Birch? Uh, you know what? I will look that stuff up later. Alright, let's climb. What are you doing? Okay. Um. Yeah, nobody's gonna notice this at all. You know, I think I would probably notice this if I was here, because I would be looking around. I'd be like, what's going on? What is that guy even doing? Doesn't make any sense. Why is he why is he doing things? So, you know, I'd be asking all sorts of questions. Probably I don't know, I most likely wouldn't alert anybody. I'd just be like, that guy's just crazy. Um but you know, to each his own, I suppose. Uh, um Yeah, okay. I want I the the thing I'm waiting for is combat. Uh, I want to see after combat what we need. Uh, where where's the best place to put my webcam? All right, let's pick this lock. Ooh, okay. Move the mouse left and right to locate and hold the tension angle. Carefully move the mouse up and down. Oh, okay. There we go, I accidentally did it. Yay! No, I don't want to hold. Uh, skip the cinematic. That'd be crazy. That'd be crazy. Okay. Find a way across. Like this, maybe? Up. Uh oh. Um. I need to go that way. These people are crazy. They don't. Oh, well, they're not crazy, but I don't want them to know I'm up here. So. Gotta be uh, the beggar's opera, eh? Uh, up here. Uh, right? I mean, left? Oh, shiza. Oh, shiza. Oh, oh. Oh, nice. 
they uh, like whoever they were just talking about. Uh, Jimmy, maybe? I don't know. Uh, could have been uh, Jamie, or Limmy, or uh, a potato. They could have been talking about a potato. Quit trying to look around the corners. Just go through the door. Crazy. Stab him. You gonna stab him yet? Hey, Phil. Yep. You should have come to me. We would have found another way. Mm -mm. Yes. But then you would have known. For what it's worth. I'm sorry. Are you? Oh, that boy just watched watch me kill that guy. Don't say anything. Or I'll kill you too, boy. Or watch yourself, son. Uh oh. That's not gonna end well. You're over here in a scream soon, right? Mm -hmm. Just walking right out. Oh, yep, there's a screaming. Oh, that may he did it. How do you guys know he did it? Why do you assume he did it? I mean, seriously, it just happened. All right, I could hold space, or I could just continue to hold the right mouse button to do it. So. I'm gonna do that. I don't need to hold space. Don't need to hold space to fast walk. I can do it with the right mouse button, seriously. I mean, hell, might as well. What order? Uh oh. These people are running around. They're insane. Yeah, where are you going? In such a hurry, too. What the hell? It's like you you murdered somebody. Yeah. Right. Oh, the door is all messed up. Oh, why'd that guy push past me? He's in more of a rush than I am. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Oh, sweet, we made it out of the building. Where's my hat? Did you get my hat? And how was the opera? Rather dull, truth be told. Yeah. My hat. Shall we be off then? Aye. To fleet and bride. By your command. Yep, by my command, bro. Actually, that's like I think that's all the time I have for this episode. I don't know. I can't see my timer. Fascinating. Gentlemen. I hold in my hand a key. Really? If this book is to be believed, it will open the doors of a storehouse built by those who came before. Nice. Ah, yes. Those who ruled, reigned, and vanished from the world. Do we know what it is that will be held within? It could contain mm -hmm. certain knowledge. Perhaps a weapon or something is awesome. unknown, unfathomable in its construction and purpose. It could be any of these things, or none of them. Right. They are still an enigma. It could be a potato. But of one thing I am certain. Whatever waits behind those doors shall prove a great boon to us all. Or a great bane. Our enemies, should they find it first. They won't. You've seen to that. I assume you know where this a... house is. Ah, Mr. Harrison. Gentlemen. How fair your calculations? I believe the site lies somewhere within this region. That's a lot of ground to cover. My apologies. Were that I could be more accurate. That's all right. It suffices for a start. And that is why we've called Correct. you here, Master Kenway. We'd like for you to travel to America, locate the storehouse, and take possession of its contents. <coughs> I well. must command. Although a job of this magnitude will require more than just myself. Of course. Upon this paper are the names of five men sympathetic to our cause. Each is also uniquely suited to aid you in your endeavor. 
With them at your side, mm. you want for nothing. Benjamin. Well, then I'd best be on my way. Very well. I knew our faith in you was not misplaced. We booked you passage to Boston. Your ship leaves at dawn. Very well. See Go you all Nathan, later. And bring honor to us all. Yeah, honor. A deadly performance. There was that a uh, special super thing that I could do, so let me check my timer. Uh, 20 minutes. I go for another 10. And we'll do uh, 30 minute segments on this one as well. Because might as well. Uh, it's, these tend to be longer games. So. I'm not sure what kind of cutscene this is. He's writing. All the words are already there, though. Oh, he's done writing. Okay. Oh, dude, there. Okay. Sure. Let's go, uh. Get some of that fresh air that you were speaking of. Uh. Let's interact with this guy. So, stuff shows up on the top right, in the bottom right, no, the bottom left. So I think, uh, let's go click this, move up here. There we go. Maybe that's good enough. A moment to talk. Ah, just one though. Londoner. Good to see I'm not the only man of means aboard. Rupert Ooh. Martin, pleased to meet you. Hey, some Are you? Where? Pleasure. Seems we picked an excellent time to leave the city. Oh? You didn't hear about the murder at the opera house? No. Oh no. What happened? They're still trying to sort it all out. And I suspect they'll be at it for a good long while. And you were right. on the moat. They've ruled out robbery. So perhaps it was a business arrangement gone sour. Or right. something more personal. More lurid. Lurid, eh? But I am glad to be away from it. The city grows more dangerous by the day. Yeah, this doesn't surprise me. Crime is always rampant. Everywhere. Oh, look, uh, another person to talk to. Are you the doctor? Good morning, doctor. Yep. Okay. Are you as well? A question, if I may. Do you serve aboard the ship, or are you simply taking passage? A bit of both, actually. I've been commissioned by the Royal Navy to study maritime illness. I'll be observing the crew during the journey. We have found that uh, sailors fare far better on the open seas than the rest of us. I hope to discover why that is. Well, I hope you are successful in your endeavors. Maybe it's because As they spend I. all their time Thank there? You the I don't know. Okay, let's, uh, oh, there's some gambling I could do. Not gonna do it, though. It does seem like it could be a good, uh, source of income later in the game. But uh, I'm not too worried about income right now. Uh, so let's head upstairs and up here. And then all will be well. Yeah. You sure about that? Of course. Have I ever led you astray? Nah. Though no, you don't sit right with the others. Have faith, my friend. You'll see. Well, well. Seems our esteemed guest has deigned to grace us with his presence. You might want to head back to your quarters. Top deck's no place for tender parnells. Are you so sure, I friend? And yet here you are. Fancy yourself a joker, eh? Yeah. Let's see how funny you find this. That's enough, Graves. Stay out of this. Now let's kick his ass. Hold E to parry. And then, oh, okay. Oh, I'm not sure what I'm doing here. Am I just keeping him at bay? Is that what's going on? Yeah, I think that's all they're having me do is deflect his attacks. Uh, 
Hold E to enter parry stance with the flag. Oh, okay. I was pressing it. I was countering and not parrying. Okay. So. That's my bad. Okay. Let's see if I can't counter him. And then beat the crap out of him. Bam! Yeah, right in the face. Please, Pat. Call this off. If the captain sees us. Right? Oh. Oh. No, I don't need a... I need a counter, and then go for the knockout. There we go. Oh, Jesus. You really destroyed that guy. We're ready to go again if you are. You destroyed his face. What is that? You think I'm afraid of you? No. But you should be. Agreed. I just destroyed that other guy. All right. Hup. Bam. And crunch. I crunched your whole face, dude. Never. Uh oh. Oh, he's pulled his dagger. I like him better. Aha! Yeah, knife is mine now, bitch. Oh, hey, bud. Explain yourself at once, Mr. Kenway. These thought we were simply passing the time with a bit of sport, Captain. Right. How about you pass the time by doing your goddamn jobs instead? I wasn't aware I was paying you to loll about. Uh, you were though. A word, Obviously, please, Mr. Kenway. Sure. Oh, I nearly forgot. There's your knife back. Yeah, bro. Jerk. Attack me. I don't care oh, for you, Mr. Kenway. So I've had nothing but trouble. I got the optional. Your problems have got nothing it to done. do with me. I beg your pardon. You're a poor leader, ill tempered and cruel, and it's clear your crew has no respect for you. True. I need to talk to this guy. Oh, they won't let me talk to that guy. Look, I don't want to argue. In fact, I need to. Oh, I think favor. that was the helmsman that I needed oh, to go talk to. Rich. Oh. I suspect some of the men intend to mutiny. Yeah. Really? What a surprise. As I cannot trust any of them, I am compelled to turn to you. And why should I help you? Yeah, dude. Because if they do intend to betray, I'm the only hope you have of reaching America alive. Oh, yeah. That's well, a good point. What will it be? If what you say is true, what other choice do I have? All of the Thank choices. You. But let me be clear. Uh-oh. She's serious you face. Dare to insult or threaten me again. I'll not hesitate but to cut off your head myself. Are we understood? <laughs> Excellent. He just nods his head quickly. Good day. <laughs> okay. Let's go up there and talk to the helmsman. Because I think that's who they're talking about. Yeah, helmsman. What's up, bro? Hello, sir. Do you Hello. Have a pleasant crossing. It is a quiet time of year, though rogue storms and troubled waters are not unheard of. But no need to fret. At worst, they'll prove an inconvenience. I'm more concerned about pirates and rogue privateers. Oh. Have you encountered them before? Aye. But the Providence is a strong ship, and her crew well trained. Are you they sure about that? They will keep us safe. Alright. Well, I actually think I'm all out of time for this episode. So this has been Goldor, a.k.a. Thalos, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye-bye!